This is the Fright Props double acting hookup kit. The double acting hookup kit comes with a five ported four way valve. Air comes in from your compressor and it goes out to one of these two ports depending on whether the solenoid is activated or deactivated. It'll flip flop. Next to the air in port are the two exhaust ports. The kit also comes with two elbow fittings with push on, three mil fittings with push on, and two debris filters for the exhaust ports. It also comes with 20 feet of polyethylene airline. To use the kit, you'll take one of the male push on fittings and put it into this center port here where your air will come in from your compressor. You'll put the two debris filters next to that. And on the other side, you'll put the other two male quick connects that will supply air to your cylinder. All of our fittings come with Teflon tape, so you don't need to put extra tape on them. You'll take the elbow fittings and put them into the double acting cylinder. Now I'm just hand tightening these, but obviously you'll need to use a wrench to tighten them down or you'll have air leaks. From there you'll take and cut the polyethylene air line and run one from the cylinder to one of the air out ports and the other to the other air out port. If your cylinder when the solenoid is deactivated is in the out position you can swap these air lines and it'll be in the down position when it's off and push out when it's activated. There's a couple optional items you might want to look at getting that do not come with the kit. You can remove these debris filters here and put speed control mufflers in there instead. What these will allow you to do is to turn the needle valve and speed up or slow down the cylinder. Another optional item is a push on fitting to compressor quick connect. This will allow you to mate the push on style to the compressor style. You only need one of these per installation because you're going to go from your compressor and then run out to all your different props. You don't need one of those if you're going to use a T or splitters coming off of this hookup kit. You'll just go and branch off to the various pneumatics and at the end of the line you'll use one quick connect.